Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, I think this is recording this time. Hello, we are playing Resident Evil. I've never played this game before, but I was watching Donkey play it, and it looked like a spooky time. And I was in the mood. So you have Resident Evil. I want to get rid of this mouse. Hmm. I changed the display to original because I assumed that would give it a more authentic and scary viewing. Hmm. We'll try wide. I think Donkey was playing it on wide. Alternate or original? I'm assuming alternate is better. Subtitles on? I think I like having subtitles on. Now, I just watched a video. I watched a 10 minute video nine, nine years ago. It was made nine years ago. Uh, tips, beginner's tips for Resident Evil. He was recommending, well, he made it sound like this was the easy mode. He didn't even talk about this one. Yeah, but nah, I'm, I'm thinking it's between these two. I like going on a hike. Good exercise, but not too strenuous. Uh, honestly, I'm more of a walker myself. I kind of like the idea of treating this like a walk, enjoying myself. Let's try this. Yes, you can relax and enjoy yourself. That's exactly what I want. As as I get better, we'll try we'll try harder. I like that idea. I think. Though I don't know. Maybe that's too easy. I do like the idea of a little bit of work. I've already seen some gameplay. You know what if I get frustrated? Hmm. I like the idea of doing a normal mode, but honestly, I like taking walks over hikes. I like relaxing and enjoying myself over good exercise, but... Hmm. Hmm. Let's do it. For this. Honestly, oh, whoa, they got costume changes. I didn't know that. That's cool. Honestly, Jill just looks straight up cooler. I also know she has more item space and gets a grenade launcher. And Chris is supposed to be the harder mode. I think now it's just a question of which, which skin. It's almost a fun idea to do that one. But that one, I think, makes a little more sense. Mm. It's almost a fun idea, though. Hmm. That one's more authentic, but that one's cooler looking. Hmm. Hmm. You know, we'll save this for like hard mode or something. Let's go with the basic. Alpha team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo team, who disappeared during the middle of their mission. Found it yet? No, not yet, Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris! Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. We continued our search for the other members, and it turned into a nightmare.
Three star divers left now. Captain Wesker, Barry, and myself. We don't know where Chris is. What is this place? Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Hey, Wesker, where's Chris? Jill, no. We don't want to go back out there. But we've got to find. What was that? Chris? No. Jill, go and investigate. I'm going with her. Chris and I go back a long way. All right. You two go. I'll secure this area. Stay sharp. Dining room. Hmm. Whoa, okay, so I can turn them around. It was so weird hearing Jill No in person. I, I'd heard it before on video somewhere else because it was such an awkward line, but that was bizarre. Can I? Okay, you can't strafe. Again. Look this way. Oh. Interesting. <laughs> I think she's got some boot physics too. This is amazing. Look at that. I'm amazing. But it is interesting, can I actually see more? No, I don't think I can see anything. I can see the edge of that chair. Can I still only see the edge of that chair? Okay. I like this. Spooky music. Ink ribbon. We can take the ink ribbon. Yes. Alright. Okay. I think you'd better take a look at this. What is it? Blood. Jill, <laughs> see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. <laughs> Let's just hope it's not Chris's. <laughs> what does he mean, examining it? What does that mean, exactly? Barry. <laughs> that was a 
amazing. Oh my gosh. Can I shoot him? There's no way they let me do that. Barry is examining the bloodstains. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to ruin. I don't want to ruin the experience if, if I can't shoot him. I don't want to break. I don't. I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to realize that's the, the border of, of reality for this one, whatever. Because I don't think they're gonna let me shoot him. But they might. Who knows? Maybe I should find out. Maybe they would let me shoot him. Turning left, but I'm going right. I'm turning right, and I go left. Interesting. Okay, what's this do? Okay, that's weird. Okay, you hold down, and it just continues into the the next. Corridor. It doesn't matter which, which direction you're facing. I was going. I'm, I'm holding down. Like, oh, that's interesting. Uh oh. Oh my gosh. Oh oh. That was bad. I don't know if that actually makes it nice. Let's do that. If I walk over to Barry. Okay, I don't think this work. I'm just curious. Barry! What is it? Look out! It's a monster! <laughs> Let me take care of it! <laughs> What the hell is this thing? I found Kenneth killed by this thing. Let's report this to Wesker. Is he gonna follow me? Well, I almost want to uh, better report back to Wesker. I can't explore all the rest of them. I wonder what would have happened if I killed that zombie without telling Barry. How's my hand? What button is it to check my hand? I'm actually doing fine, okay. Got that equipped. Okay. Or do I? It doesn't look like I have anything equipped. What is that? Is that a good okay. Alright, whatever. Got files. Okay. Is he coming back up? What was that? He's gone! What? Where did he go? Must have gone into the, the room again. Wesker! <laughs> Jill, help me look for him. Let's not leave this hall. Good idea. Face. A heavy looking picture. Let's not leave this hall, he said. So I guess he doesn't want to go in any doors. It's down here. Does interesting. Barry. Any luck, Jill? No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure it out. Same here. Chris and now Wesker. There's not much we can do. We can search for him separately. I'll investigate the dining room again. Okay, then I'll try the door on the other side. <sighs> the 
This mansion is gigantic. We could easily get lost. Let's start from the first floor. Okay. Oh! I almost forgot. It's a lockpick. You'd make better use of it. <laughs> Got the lockpick. Thanks. I may need it. Listen. If something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Got it? Okay. So, will they not let me go to the second floor? What is this? Is this a secret wall? That's weird. Oh, an outside. Let's just let's just stick with what they say. Oh wait, was that something sparkling? It's locked from the other side. Bummer. Okay. Well, that almost has me curious. Is there anything here to find? We got some shotgun shells. And we know now to look for an arrowhead and where that arrowhead may be used. Okay. Will they let me go upstairs? It looks like I can't go upstairs. That's so weird. That's not what he said to do. I don't know if I want to do it. Well, but I mean, we're not, I'm not leaving the hall. I gotta find out if they'll let me actually do this. No. No, he said to stay on the first floor. That might give me a bad ending. I'm just content doing this. He's in the dining hall, he said. I said I would go look on the other side of the dining hall. I mean, the, the other side of the door. The door on the other side of the dining hall. Which I think. Initially, I thought that meant. The door that's here. Is, is, is he here? Is he in the dining room? He's not in the dining room. He went this way though. There's no. Nothing. Oh, hello. Locked from the other side. Am I gonna get trapped if I run the other way? I'll just be able to shoot him, I'm sure. Okay. I gotta find out what's, what's, what's on. Okay. I don't think zombies can open doors. I'll find out, I guess. No spooky music anymore. Is it a picture of? Okay. 
Whoa. Interesting. Will you take the green herb? Sure. I guess I'll take this other one while it's here. Maybe I should leave it? Come back? I feel like I should just take it. But I don't know. Who knows what all I'm going to find here. I gotta... I'll leave it. And I'll come back for it. A large bird cage. There's a dead raven inside. Really? I'm realizing I'm basically doing the opposite of what he said to do just by... Well, actually, I don't know if it's the opposite. I guess, yeah. I'm realizing he said the other side of the dining hall. He probably meant the room opposite of the dining hall, not the room on the other side of the dining hall from, from the dining hall, whatever. Okay. Is this over here? Oh, there's a mirror. Yeah, there's a zombie right there. I gotta start uh, memorizing where I am. That would probably do me some good. Okay. There's an inscription on the shield. Death is only the beginning. You know, I think this is a death room. I think I got a I got a couple of spoilers watch I I, I I half watched half listened to Duncan's playthrough and that was resembling a death room to me. Be, oh my gosh! He's right. ah, yes. <laughs> it's locked from the other side. Oh okay, the camera. You gotta work with the camera. Will you take the golden arrow? Yes. Whoa, what happened? From the status screen, select an item, and then select the examine command. The details of the item will be displayed. Okay. Golden arrow. Well, the indentation was for an arrow head, not an arrow, but the arrow head looks like it can be removed. Uh huh. Well, the arrowhead is made from peridot, sometimes referred to as a poor man's emerald. Interesting. It's kind of pretty. Interesting. Very pretty. I like that I can examine Okay. I guess I got rid of the wand. Uh. In the video, the guy was like, you can run past most zombies, you don't need to shoot them off. So now I'm wondering, like, which ones to shoot and which ones not to shoot. How do I not have anything in my hand? Okay, yeah, I've nothing in my hand now. Now I'm, like, super fast. Whoa, what did I just pick up? Will you take the handgun magazine? Sure. Okay. You unlocked it. Cause the other thing, another spoiler I got was that once you kill the zombies, if you don't burn them, uh, they come back as stronger zombies. And I don't know. I don't know if I want to deal with that. Yes. Sure. Using defensive items such as daggers will allow you to escape momentarily when grabbed by an enemy. However, you will not be able to escape when the enemy grabs you from behind. To equip a defensive item, go to the status screen and then select an item from the defensive item menu. Then, to equip a defensive, go to the status screen and then select an item from the defensive item item menu. Then select the equip command. If your defensive item 
mode is set to manual in the controller settings, you must press LB to use a defensive item. If your defensive item mode is set to manual in the controller settings. Okay. Am I set to me? I like it. We're set on auto, and I think I like that. Oh, wow. And this is literally all the instructions. You can reload with the B button. You can run with the X. I didn't know that. 180 degree turn. I tried that. Didn't... I guess, yeah. Never mind. It does turn you around exactly. Move with the L. Jamming target with LB. Interesting. How does this work? Okay. It doesn't, it doesn't seem like running is really working. Maybe they mean with an item equipped. The guy said you run faster when you don't have the item equipped, but it doesn't seem like that's... I can't tell if that's true or not. Yeah, I guess it's slightly true. Now, X doesn't seem to do anything. X is run? How does that work? What does that mean? I don't get it. Yeah, I don't know what they mean by that. Uh, I'm messing up the start button with the... Oh, looks like my defensive item is already equipped. What am I doing? I think I do like my own. You know what? Let's this. Oh, is she holding something? Oh, you can push it though. You must be right around. Where is he? I don't know where that needs to be. So I don't know. A stained glass window. The pattern in the center resembles a woman. Am I supposed to move this all the way over there? The pattern in the middle resembles. It looked like a woman to me, but am I seriously supposed to move this? Or it looks like this is broken here. Am I supposed to move here? Well, I can understand why you would want to kill the zombie. How does it work? Let me try. I'm curious about the daggers. Was someone running at me? It almost looked like that. Or was that a shadow? Nope, that's just a shadow. Can I... Oh, fun. Alright. Grab me. Come on. Lunge for me. Come on. Ah, aha! Oh no! We made it to the second floor. That's what happened. We stayed on the first floor. We're, we're on the second floor. Hmm. I gotta find a saving room. Can I, is this anything? You can't make anything out through the darkness and the fog. 
this is a fun picture, an oil painting in a large frame. It's been well preserved, and the people in it are still vividly depicted. Interesting. Another, another picture, an oil painting in a large frame. The painting is dried and cracked. Well, I don't really know where I'm going. It is easy to get lost in here. I'm realizing I should have grabbed some uh, some green rooms. I'm gonna try and find a saving room, and then, well, I got that arrow thing. I guess I'll use it. It's just taking up space. Let's not. Let's 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 get it. Let's get the gun. I'm not a pro yet. It's just, yeah. A tomb engraved with a picture of an angel. There's an indentation in the shape of an arrowhead. I gotta stop using the start button. statue with a hole where the eyes should be. A stone statue with a holes where the eyes, nose, and mouth should be. A stone statue with a hole where the nose should be. A stone statue with a hole where the mouth should be. This? There's a key embedded on the back cover. Will you remove it? Yeah. You got the mansion key. Book of Curses. <gasps> book of Curses. A book of curse. Of a curse. When all four fall into place, evil will awaken its voices. The four masks. A mask that speaks no evil. A mask that smells no evil. A mask that sees no evil. A mess that cannot speak, smell, or see. When all four are into place, evil will awaken. saw the guy in the YouTube video examine this key. It says mansion key on the bottom left. But, check it. Hey, there's an engraving of a sword. A sword key. And as I recall, there was something, there was a door that was, uh, needed a sword key. So far, this lockpick has not been, um, very useful at all. How does this work? Lockpick. A tool for unlocking most simple locks. Should I, do I actually need to click it and, like, it when I come face to face with the locked door? And does it have a limited amount of uses? I see one, two, three, four, five. Interesting. Okay. I can't promise that I'm going to record this whole game, but I wanted to record something. So I have not been to the right side yet. I know, though, at the very least. I want to find a saving room. Maybe there's one on the right side. Whoa. What's this? 
woman drawing water. Hmm. There's something sparkling. Woman drawing water. I don't know how you reach it. Interesting. Whoa. Oh. I can maybe push this drawer and get that thing. An old photograph sits in the frame. Maybe this person was connected to the mansion somehow. I wish I could actually look at the picture. That's a bummer. A portrait hangs on the wall. It almost seems like it's watching you. This looks like a series of portraits. The music's really creepy in here too. A portrait hangs on the wall. Okay. Same deal. A portrait hangs on the wall. These all just portraits on the wall. Portraits and photographs decorate the wall. It looks like they could come to life at any moment. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Well, the awkward thing. Oh, oh. You know, I think I have to go around and push it. You use the sword key. Uh -huh. Interesting, all the different doors. Oh. Various sculptures and bits of pottery. You can really look at the boob physics here. It's a little something, I don't know. But, you know, hey, attention to detail. Whoa! What's there? my health. We're really being a little dangerous here. Something tells me I'm not going to find a save room here. What's this? A picture of the mansion suspended in darkness. Mm. This would lead us back to the pottery room, right? A picture of the mansion against the setting sun. Goodness. Nothing here yet. We're really backing ourselves into a corner. My gosh. How far is it going here? Uh, I think I saw game footage and this was a death trap room. <laughs> I, I got spoiled on something. Maybe just the first quarter of the game and a few little bits of halfway through the game. I know. I know. I'm sorry, but... But what can you do? I haven't saved yet. If I saved, I would be a little more frivolous, but I have not saved yet. This is not a safe room, and I think there's going to be something scary in here, too. I gotta save, man. Well, I think it's in the bathtub. If there's anything in here, it's in the bathtub. It's a full of dirty water. Remove the plug. Uh, I'm being risky. Let me see what's over here first. Nothing. It doesn't look like it's been serviced in a while. Mm. Okay. Let me save first, man. I gotta save. That was the death trap room. What's over here? Ah, 
maybe it's not a death trap, who knows? I have no idea where I am. Wow. So, in progress. Because I went all the way over there. I couldn't get past that dresser. <sighs> this is the first floor. I did that whole weird loop thing. My goodness. A picture of a woman praying in front of a large crowd. Wow! Okay, no! Oh. I see some herbs though. The wall is lined with portraits. All of the faces have been painted out. You know what? Let's kill my first one. Okay. It's right there. Is there one up here too? That's fine. It's locked. An emblem of an armor is carved into the lock. Am I backing myself into a corner? Are we gonna die here? Okay. Not today. I wonder if he's gonna stay harmed by all those things I shot into him. Okay, yeah, let's take the herb. And sure, let's take this... Well... Yeah, sure. What is this? I don't know how that one works. I don't have any... Well... Alright, there we go. I gotta find a place to save. What is in here? Like bottles? An unlit fireplace? Oh, a little detail of the, the room. The house. Books. The dark forest stretches as far as your eye can see. There don't seem to be any houses in the area. A picture of a partly built mansion. It looks an awful lot like the one you're in now. Hmm. A coat. I mean... Who knows what I'm gonna find? It's locked. An emblem of a helmet. So we've got a helmet and armor. So I guess I won't be able to do anything here until I find those. Uh, okay, so we gotta move our way past those zombies. I'm just gonna shoot them at this point. And then check out those other rooms, I guess. Can I... Wait, they said I could reload with the B button. How's that work? Oh, you gotta aim and then reload, but shaboom. Okay. Did that, that almost didn't seem like it drained any of the uh, handgun magazine. I thought I was already at 10. How's that work? Weird. I kind of want to pick this up right now while I'm here. Let's do it. What is it? Will you take the red herb? I don't even know what it does. I didn't, you know, I haven't even examined, I didn't even examine what the, whatever this one is. Green herb. An herb that grows wild in this region. That's all it says. Well, who knows what this one does. Maybe it's just a more potent green herb. I mean, yeah. Examine. An herb that grows wild in this region. Okay. Alright, let's shoot some zombies. Are they going to follow me? Where are they? Picture of a woman being menaced. I can't even tell if I'm. It's locked. Get a gun. She's not walking over here. Okay. Oh my gosh, camera. Four, five, six, seven. I think that's how much that was. 
And is he gonna stay down? Okay. So I think it takes eight total kills. I just got an achievement. First kills are special. I didn't do my first one. Alright. Oh, this is the door. door here. There's no knob on this door. You can't go through. Bummer. You unlocked it. With the lock pick or what? I didn't think to even use the lock pick on the uh, armor and whatever. But what is this? You can't carry any more items. Well, how's my health? I'm fine. Is there a safe room somewhere? What's this? Anywhere? Not a save room. More stuff to pick up. Uh. Mm. Hey, this looks familiar. Oh, wait. I just took this back around somehow. Oh, it took us... Oh, interesting. It did a loop. I think there was one more door in here, though. On the other side. Anything over here? It's locked. An emblem of an armor is carved in the lock. Have I been here? No, I have not been here. Right? Oh my gosh. No. Yeah, it's on the other side. Okay. What about this? Can I use it? It's not necessary to use this now. Okay, fine, whatever. What is this? It's like half broken. The glass has been broken and the picture inside has been removed. Alright. It's locked. An emblem of armor is carved in the lock. Alright. You use the sword key. Fantastic. Okay, here we are. can unlock that room in the, the right, I think. I think that's what's up. We're on floor two right now. Can I do anything? I didn't investigate to the left as much as I could have, it looks like. I've got freed up space, though, now, I think, with the sword key, right? No? I guess not. I saw in the video also that they let you toss things once you, like, used it all the way or whatever. What's here? It's locked. An emblem of armor is carved into the lock. Oh, I've already been here. It's locked from the other side. Where do I think a safe room would be? Hmm. What? There's a typewriter down there? Oh my gosh. In the dining room of all places. Okay. Should I do that? I don't actually know how much progress I've really made. I'm gonna stop. Um,